Apple has launched a unique challenge. It's offering a $1 million reward for anyone who can hack into the servers of its upcoming Apple Intelligence Service. This unprecedented bug bounty program is designed to identify potential vulnerabilities and strengthen the service's defenses before its official release next week. The newly announced Apple Intelligence Service will process certain requests through advanced servers. To ensure these servers are airtight, Apple is inviting the world's top security experts, hackers, and researchers to rigorously test its systems. This bounty is a massive call for security talent to help keep Apple's AI-powered services secure. Apple's private cloud compute, PCC, servers, where intensive data processing will happen, are central to this initiative. When a user's device can't handle a request alone, PCC servers step in. Apple wants to ensure these servers can withstand any security threat, so it's welcoming experts to search for weaknesses. Ahead of the launch, Apple has made its servers accessible to privacy experts for thorough inspection. It has also deployed a virtual research environment, or VRE, where participants can dive into a replica of PCC's software and systems to test security features in a controlled environment. Apple has published a comprehensive private cloud compute security guide, shedding light on the architecture of PCC. This guide explains how requests are authenticated, how software operates securely in Apple's data centers, and the numerous layers of defense PCC has against potential cyber attacks. The security guide is a resource for researchers, offering insight into Apple's protocols to prevent unauthorized data access and protect user privacy. It highlights Apple's commitment to transparency and robust security measures in handling sensitive data across its network. With its virtual research environment, Apple is giving researchers a Mac-based platform to inspect PCC's software releases closely. Participants can monitor security updates, interact with specific pieces of code, and even view open-source segments Apple has made available on GitHub. The million-dollar bounty focuses on three main areas of vulnerability accidental data disclosure, external compromise via user requests, and breaches through physical or internal access points. Apple is looking for flaws that could expose data due to design or configuration errors, malicious exploitation of user requests, or unauthorized access by internal or external actors. First, accidental data disclosure covers flaws in server configurations or software design that might inadvertently expose user data. Apple wants to eliminate any chance of unintentional leaks through rigorous testing by security experts. Second, external compromise targets vulnerabilities where hackers could exploit user requests to gain unauthorized access. This means identifying any way an attacker could manipulate requests to infiltrate Apple's secure servers. Finally, Apple is interested in any internal access breaches where unauthorized individuals could physically or remotely access PCC's secure servers. This category addresses possible flaws in the interfaces or protocols that should restrict internal access. Though these categories cover the main bounty areas, Apple is willing to award bounties for any security flaw that could significantly impact PCC's operations. The reward will depend on the severity and potential impact of the vulnerability, showing Apple's commitment to making its intelligence services as secure as possible.